Hi guys and welcome to Gadgets World. So today I'm just going to be showing you how to take out the LCD on your Lenovo X230. Now first thing you want to do is remove the battery and second thing you want to do is open the thing. So uh, as you can see here and here you've got little covers. These are headers for your screws. So if I just take that off with a utility knife you can see the silver screw that's just there. Now we're going to reuse these, so just put those to the side. And just lift from the top and remove it like so. Next thing, it's pretty pr pretty standard. You're just going to be unscrewing them. Two screws, one, one on the right, one on the left. Now, here's the uh, tricky part. Now there are a few ways to open it. You can, uh, if you have a fingernails, which currently I don't, you can lift from the inside, you can lift from the bottom, lift from the top. If you've got a crack on your bezel at all, you can lift from the top there. Uh, personally, I prefer lifting from the bottom, as it's the as I find it the easiest. You lift from the bottom and run your finger along the side. Make sure to make it balanced so nothing gets snapped or cracked. Sorry about that. Now I'm just going to lift from the bottom here, running my finger along the side now. Trapped. So I'm just going to grab the pry tool and run it along the outside or through the inside. See, simple enough. And that just comes straight off. Put that to the side. Now, what I'm going to be showing you, as you can see that you have a screw here and a screw there. There is also, let me just adjust the camera. Yeah, there's also a screw here and a screw here. Now, there's the hinge frame, which runs, starts there and ends there, but we're not going to be worrying about that now. What we do have to worry about is making sure that we don't interrupt the cables and that we're careful when doing so. I'm just going to undo these screws. There we go. Now what we want to do is now we want to lift the LCD out and place it down so we can disconnect it. So I'm just going to grab from the top, holding it, and lift out. Now you can see just there, yeah that's in shot, you can see just here that the cable is wrapped through this little section there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to lift using the tweezers. Just lift that out so it doesn't become caught. Lift out again and ta-da. Like so, we've disconnected. Now you see the uh, the connector there. That is a, it's a 40 pin connector, I believe. Now it's got a little plastic shrouding on the top of it. We're going to remove from the top. If this becomes a bit too difficult, and it's like this one, you can use the utility blade just to lift the corner. For you to then use the tweezers. And as I always say, use the tweezers till you can get a good hold on it. It's like hand. You allow more control. There we go. Now I'm just going to disconnect. Moving. And there you go. Screen's completely out. And you can put the new screen back in. And to reinstall the new one, you simply just carry on through. Plug it in. 
and put it back in place. Uh, till next time, I've been Alex, and this has been Gadgets World. Thank you.